Hi, uh, I'm here today with the Burton Custom Twin Camber uh, with off axis, which means it's asymmetric. Uh, it's a twin shape, uh, quite stiff throughout. We've been riding this today in really slushy spring conditions, all over the mountain, hitting kind of side hits, that kind of riding. Um, it handled really well, really stable, really grippy. You could really feel the edge digging in um, and it didn't feel like it slid, slid out at all. Uh, the pop is really nice. Um, you know, if you've got a good pop, it just reacts to what you want. So the rider you want to be to ride this board is quite an advanced rider, um, maybe looking for those big hits. Uh, you know how to carve a board, you know how to pop a board. Uh, you don't really want to be looking at this if you're in the kind of beginner, intermediate scale. It's also a really good board if you like the big jumps or if you like the big hits on the side or dropping cliffs or whatnot. It's still quite soft in the middle, but stiff underfoot. Uh, so you could still maybe hit rails and stuff like that. It's just a good all round mountain board. To compare this to the True Twin Custom without off axis technology, uh, this one would be looking at more of your park rider, whereas the, the True Twin Custom would probably be looking at more the, the cruiser around the piece or, you know, powder board. The graphics are done by Juan Francis Cocasas. Try saying that 10 times fast. Um, I don't know what to say about it really. It's a little bit, you know, if you're into that kind of thing. Maybe uh, this is a board for you. It's a bit on the spectrum. But again, if I hold it like that, you get the, you get the idea. Yeah? Cool. Well done, Juan. Good guy. <laughs> <laughs>